What's up everybody, Mike Ladisa here from Croc Center Chicago. This is part three of a five part series on developing a power practice routine. If you missed parts one and two, check them out on our Facebook page. We're applying the concept of smart goals toward music development and practice. So today we're looking at A in the SMART acronym and A stands for attainable or actionable depending on what you read. And these would refer to two different things but they're related. Uh, attainable really just means that uh, I picked a goal that uh, is really realistic, right? And accomplishable in the time frame I have. Uh, oftentimes students want to play too fast, too quickly, uh, and it's not attainable to get it uh, in control. So, or too, students want to play music that's too difficult. We, we see them make poor decisions for auditions or recitals. And so uh, most people, I think maybe even all people, would rather hear a simpler piece played well than a difficult piece played poorly. Think about that. Uh, I think it, it holds true almost all the time, right? Uh, so that's attainable. Actionable, this is like the nuts and bolts of your plan, all right? So um, here's a, a piece that's two pages long. If I had given a month to learn this, that month there's four weeks in a month, uh, two pages, that means I have to get through at least a half a page every week. If I were to do less than that, I would not be able to attain th this piece in the time given. All right, so what are you working on right now? Uh, when do you expect to attain it? What is your action plan? I'd love to hear about it. Send me an email. Mike Ladisa from Croc Center Chicago. Goodbye.